Just a short little video demonstrating thoughts what for Google Sheets analyzing World Cup data. So in this uh, Google Sheets we have 2018 and 2022 data. As the World Cup starts, obviously we'll start getting the data published for 2022. But if I want to just do some quick analysis of uh, 2018, I can go to my extensions, launch the Thought Spot for Google Sheets application, which will then analyze this data set and appropriately group the columns as either measures or attributes. If we did want to swap to 2022, we can easily do that by just selecting the selector and I can switch over. As I said, this has not been populated with data at this point, so we'll just leave it on 2018. So now I can start using ThoughtSpot for Google Sheets to investigate the data. Maybe I want to have a look at uh, which teams scored the most goals. Let's have a look at team name and maybe you want to have a look at got total goals. Very easily I can see that. These are the teams that scored the most goals during the competition. If I want to, I can easily drill down. Maybe I want to have a look at this by who are the players that scored the goals. So I can just let's select drill down, player display name. We see Harry Kane, uh, Stones, Maguire and Trippier all scored. Maybe I want to, instead of having a look at it by common name, I want to see which positions were these players picked in. So we can see here we've got forwards and defenders. You know, some of the other fun things we can have a look at, but I just want to clear this. Maybe we want to have a look at who were the players that, uh, so we have player name. And let's have a look at who uh, were the most successful at dribbling um, past their opponents. So let's just limit that to the top 50. Let's go actually top, uh, top 20. Probably makes more sense. So we can see here, here are the individuals that were the most successful in getting past their opponents, carrying the ball forward. Um, if we wanted to add that to, maybe we want to see who was actually making the most attempts for this. And if we wanted to see who was making the most attempts by the top 20, let's just remove success. And we can see here that the top two were um, Mbappe and Hazard, but we saw with the uh, success, if we put success back, now we can see that Hazard was a little bit more successful than Mbappe was at getting past. Here's the different attributes we can analyze by coach. We can you know where players were born, um, what positions, what teams. Here are all the different you know um, measures that are available. So we might want to have a look at maybe shots on target. And let's have a look at that by team name again. So we can see that you know Belgium had the most shots on target. But if we want to also have a look at that by, you know, actually how many goals were sought, stored total goals. So we can see that as well. So even though Belgium had the most on target, you know, comparably the most goals, eight goals. Um, if you have a look at France, etc. And maybe just quickly, maybe we want to have a look at um, players' names, common name again. So we might want to have a look at saves inside the box. Let's have a look at that. And let's just look at the top 10, who are the goalkeepers that were most successful in this. So this is a fun little video, just demonstrating thoughts what for Google Sheets. This data is made available using TS Sync so that we can publish this data out as the games are completed.